All right, so in another video, I demonstrated some of the properties of the Rica tube. And as a reminder, the way that works is if you put it over a flame, this is very heavy metal, so my hand isn't getting hot. You should be careful when handling this. If you take it away, you get a sound. And if you move it sideways or upside down, you get nothing until you bring it back to its original orientation. Now, in the, in the other video, I didn't explain the secret of this so you could think about it a little bit. If you look inside the tube, um, what you'll find is there is a bit of metal mesh inside there. So although the flame is heating air, it's also heating the metal mesh. And when I take that away, what that metal mesh can do is heat up any air um, from the outside or even cooler air from the inside. And um, that, that heating effect will increase the pressure, this current of, of air becoming hotter from colder is what drives what we call a standing wave in this pipe and the wavelength of the sound that you get is about twice the length of this pipe which is the fundamental frequency for a pipe that's open at both ends. So uh, what the mesh in there is what drives it in this case. It's also why when I heated the other end you would get a slightly different sound and the effect wouldn't work when you pulled it away.